in this video let me show you how can you use new feature of google gemini 2.0 to generate a comic book and that too absolutely for free as of now this particular model is available on preview and this is the time using which you will be able to generate your comic book and that too absolutely for free let me show you very quickly currently i am in google home page and there if i just type google ai studio then you will be able to see this option and if i click on it then google ai studio will open so if you are first time using google ai studio then you can use your google credential to log in and this doesn't cost anything here you need to ensure one thing from the left pane create prompt option should be selected and in the right pane gemini 2.0 flash image generation experimental model is selected and you can also see input output cost is zero here now this is the prompting area and where I'll now paste one prompt, generate 20 different cartoon style images, which are ultra photorealistic, high quality for a fictional cartoon story of a person went inside a jungle after his boat crash. Use his boat crash as a starting point and imagine the next sequence of scenes. Other few of the things I also mentioned here, which are very very important keep the character and the outfit extremely consistent you must add this particular phase as part of your prompt if you want to generate consistent images of a same character now if i hit enter let's see what it generates so it started generating and this is image number one and this is the first image which it generated and then this next one and let's see how it evolves okay this is the next image and you can see the character is consistent but it's not adding much of the variation it's the same image is generating again and again with very slight changes but i'll show you another thing it generated this is another tab here i gave the same prompt and this is what it generated and it generated properly this time you can see this is the first image then second then third yeah this is the fourth fifth one it's keeping the character consistent and it is really going through the storyline now one thing i observed if you are using this tool multiple times with a very short period of time then it starts giving some of the errors sometimes it doesn't generate sometimes it generates the duplicate images all those things because currently it's on preview right because this is an experimental model where google is trying to experiment and trying to understand what is working what is not so this is bit buggy currently but i think considering it's generating consistent images and that too also for free maybe we'll be able to live with that for now right so this is the way you will be able to generate all these images now let me come back and show you a few more things this is one image right if i click on it you can see this is the image it generated now if i click on this button it will download you can also click on this particular button to download everything now once your images are generated you need to download it first and in a single folder so that all of the images will be in the same place what we have done initially we gave one prompt to google gemini using that it created a storyline it also generated those images it also added some of the text which you can add later in your comic book and based on that you will be able to proceed now our images are ready now let me show you the next step what i can do what i'll do i'll open canva and there we will be able to put everything together earlier i was trying with the same thing what i'll do i'll open this same document for you you can click on this custom size image to create a new one and there you will be able to mention the size of your page what are the size you are looking for the dimension that you can mention and you can create a new design for now i'll click on cross and i'll open this existing one which i was trying to use what i've done i have added those three initial images here just by copy paste so let me do one thing if i click on this new page then i'll be getting a blank document right and there i'll be able to show you how to do it once you upload your images those will be available here i'll go to this folder and there these are all images i have i'll do step by step first one is this one that's being uploaded so now second one also we uploaded so if i click on the first one the image will come here then the second one it will come here and this is the way you will be able to upload other images 
and you will be able to edit and you will be able to resize everything you can do. Let me show you another very good option within Canva. What you can do. This is one very simple blank document, right? But if you go to a new page and there you go to elements and there you click on frames. I was trying few of the frames here. So if I select this particular frame, so it comes with three image frame. If I come to upload again, and if I click on this particular image, this image will come and that will fit in this frame. You don't need to do anything. It will fit automatically and similar way, this image may be here, it will fit. And let's just for an example, if I use this other image, which I generated just now, I can put it here. So this is the way once you will be able to upload all of your images in Canva, you'll be able to stitch it together and then you will be able to add your creative flair there. Let me very quickly show you if you come to elements and if you search for frame then it will show you multiple different options under frames if you click on see all then there are a number of options you can just keep scrolling down and you will be able to find a huge collection of frames you can choose from i leave it up to your creativity how you'll do it but main point of this particular video was to how can you generate multiple ai images of a same character so that you will be able to create your comic let me know in the comments below if you are facing any issues or is it working for you and based on that we can discuss further. So this is covering how can you generate consistent images. If you want to know five more other AI based tools using which you can generate unlimited AI images then check out this video to know everything about it.